Okay, our question was, what are the causes of overpopulation in India, and what can be done to reduce their population? And the most valuable guiding questions that we thought were, uh, for the solution was uh, the one-child policy, if implementing that would help reduce the population, and the research we did would help it reduce it if the population was willing to um, put it into effect. Uh, how does the caste system affect overpopulation? Uh, since people of different uh, society rankings will have more money or less money, they're going to want to know if uh, they should have a bigger family or, or smaller family. Um, how is the geography of India affecting overpopulation? Uh, we found that one was pretty significant because of, it's such a different kind of land mass. China's landmass is just one big, it's all pretty connected, but India's mountainous regions just kind of split it all up and everything. And then what kind of surprises did we encounter during our research was definitely the fact that they were willfully ignorant about it. They didn't just not know. I mean, they know that they're overpopulated, but they continue to want a large family because they don't have a social, social security system set up so that when they get older they don't get money after they're retired because they don't put savings into it their entire life. So they want a large family so that their children, if they have a lot of children, they can help support them when they get older. So they know they're overpopulated and they know that it's dangerous. They know the uh, consequences of it. And yet they continue to do it just because they kind of need to because when they get older they're not going to have any kind of support system since they don't have social security or uh, anything like that. So they need a large family to help support them once they're older and unable to work. And what resources are most valuable? We definitely use EBSCO a lot, the one on, from the library website, because that had the most broadest search engine for the one that we looked for, but also had a lot of details within those search engines so that we were able to find a lot of different websites that all dealt with solutions to the population of India to reduce it and so the uh, so EBSCO is really the most helpful. We didn't use Google because we didn't want to have any unreliable websites and EBSCO was recommended so that's the most helpful most valuable resource we used to find so our population, I mean, our question was, what are the causes of overpopulation in India, and what can be done to reduce the population? And it's by Emily Keller and Melinda Hale.